everyone and welcome to my channel. My name is Febri. In today's video, as you guys can see on the screen, I have not logged into Roblox yet because I am going to be hacking into my boyfriend's account. I mean, it's not necessarily hacking because I did ask if I can go into his account. So, I mean, it's not hacking. I asked for permission. But anyway, I thought it would be better for the title. So I'm hacking into one of's account today on Roblox. And I've been on there quite a few times. Usually it's like for role plays. If I need to change his outfit, then I will just do it for him. But today I'm going to be nosy, which he doesn't know. So I just want to be nosy on his account. So let's log in and just see what's on his account. Oh my gosh, look at that. I've hacked in. Beautiful. I'm in people. Okay, where do I look first? First of all, we've got a nice amount of Robux right there. Maybe I should just pay it to myself. But we can see that he's got 198 friends. He can only have two friends remaining. Oh my gosh, that's not a lot of people. Oh my gosh, look, there I am with my blue tick there. It's so weird seeing that now. A verified badge icon. Let's click on myself, actually. Has he given me a thumbs up? Oh, he has. I don't know what this actually means, but when you like download, I think it's from this, Ropro, which is like an add-on on Roblox, you can give people thumbs up and he has given me a thumbs up, so I'm very happy about that. I have to say my character looks very good from the outside. Very nice, very nice. Okay, let's go back. As you can see, look, I'm not even online. Offline for one day. That's because I've been hacking into my boyfriend's account. Okay, let's see what games he's recently been playing. Let's go and see all. Okay, so recently he played Don't Run People Over. That is a bit suspicious. I haven't even heard of that game. And it looks like you do run people over in that game. Oh, look at this, guys. This is juicy. Look, Parenthood Beta Map Staging. As you guys know... Parenthood will be having a revamp this year. So many comments on my video saying like, what happened to Parenthood? Where is Parenthood? Guys, don't worry. Josh is just making the game better for everyone. He's revamping the map. I think there actually is some spoilers maybe on his Twitter. Let's go ahead and have a look. Yes, so as you guys can see on here, we are on the One of Games Twitter page. And as you guys can see, there are some sneak peeks of the Parenthood map, which is coming along. Look how cool. This is one of the pictures they have uploaded. Honestly, guys, I've actually seen the map and it is crazy how good it is. I'm so excited for the game to come out. And also, Josh has done a new rebranding for like his game, which looks really cute as well. It's like little buddy. It's so adorable. I love it. So make sure you guys go ahead and follow this Twitter page because where Josh basically shows all parenthood ideas which are coming. And even look at this. I mean, look at the trees. It just looks so cool. I'm so excited for parenthood to come back out in 2023. It's going to come back bigger and better. I'm excited to record videos on it. And don't worry, you guys will be able to get your babies back. So yeah, the game will just be much better than it was before because Josh is a bit of a perfectionist and he loves his games to be a 10 out of 10 and that's exactly what parenthood is going to be. Anyway, sorry about that tangent I went on. Let's go back to stalking my boyfriend. So he's also played Berry Avenue, of course, because he's a coder on there. And um, we've also got Parent, who's I guess he's been playing it just to see what it's like. He's been on Please Donate, begging people for donations. No, I'm joking. I think he's actually been giving out donations, which is very cute. This is also like the testing server of Berry Avenue. So he's been in the testing one. He's been playing Arsenal. Go to jail and make friends. Josh, what type of games have you been playing? Okay, what else is on here? The Mad Murderer? Okay, I'm getting a bit suspicious, guys. It's a bit scary. Please steal? I mean, what is all of this? There's a lot of horror games on here, which I'm actually surprised by because Josh doesn't usually like horror games. I mean, look, Michael's Zombies. And then over here, we have the Mad Murderer. I mean, these are all like horror games. Oh, he's been playing Snakey still though, which is cute. But yeah, these are all the games that they, he has been playing. So now I know what he's been up to. Okay, let's check his profile out. So this is what he looks like so far. I think I will give him a makeover later because he needs a bit of a revamp. He's had this outfit for too long, so don't worry. We will give him a makeover. Oh my gosh, he has more thumbs up than I do. <gasps> That is so sad. But yes, he says, program of Berry Avenue, creator of Parenthood, previously at Snakey Outbreak, Saving Christmas, and many more. I am not on there, which I'm very sad about. Where is the message about me, okay? Being an amazing girlfriend. I also want to be on there. Oh, we can see his favorites, which is Berry Avenue, Snakey, Parenthood, Saving Christmas, and Outbreak, all the ones that, that he has played. We can also see what groups he is in. Oh my gosh, he's in a lot of groups. Where's my group? Where's my group? Ah, uh, there we are. Beautiful. Oh, yes, we can see his inventory. See what he's, um, what he bought. Like, why has he bought this? A plush duck hoodie. I've never seen him wear that. 
Oh, but look, he is a supporter. He buys all of the UGC, like the black sunglasses by Amber. He bought all of our hair braids. Okay, I've now clicked on passes to see where all of his Robux goes. And look at all of this. I mean, look, 1,000 for all of these. What has he been buying? These are so expensive. I don't know what they are. Okay, he spends a lot of his Robux. I mean, what even are all of these? Oh my gosh, look at this one. 100,000 Robux. That means how much he spent on this. Oh, that's insane. I think these are things that you buy on Please Donate. I'm guessing so. Yeah, look, Please Donate here. So he gave someone 100,000 Robux. And this person too. 25,000. Oh my gosh, why is he not giving this money to me? Oh my gosh, he gives out a lot of money on here. I can't like, look, another 100,000. Another 100,000. Okay, next time I ask for Robux, Josh, you can't say no. Okay, here we have some game passes. We have the Vehicle Pack 1 on Berry Avenue. We also have the Luxury Yacht on there as well. So these are some game passes that he actually has bought. Let's see anything else that I can... Oh, private servers. Let's see what he spends his money on. Oh my gosh, he's got loads of private servers. Look at all of these. Okay, how many pages are there? Okay, only two pages, not too bad. But how many does he have on these? Look, so many different private servers for Phantom Forces. Okay, on here we can also see places that he has created himself. You can see if there's any games coming out. You know, it doesn't look like it. We have the Berry Avenue, probably like a test server. We have a meeting server. A Pigeon Royale. There's such random stuff in here. One million. Could this be for me? A lot of people. Yeah, he has a lot of random places on here. Okay, I'm confused on what this one means. Adopt and raise a cute. And I was like, okay, so what's the sentence? Like a cute baby? But no, adopt and raise a cute job. What does that mean, Josh? <laughs> what does that mean? Okay, anyway, let's get to the best part, which is the makeover. Oh my gosh, I just took his hair off by accident. He's gonna be bored. Actually, you know, maybe that'd be quite a good look. Yeah, look, very nice. Um, let's see his creation, because he has a lot of creations on here. You guys don't know how many outfits he has. Look at all of these. I mean, look, a bunny one. There's a clown, which is called a bunny, which makes no sense. There's a snowman that's called a rat. Oh, Santa Claus. And also Piggy. There's just a lot of random stuff on here. I made him this one before. It even says my girlfriend made this because I did actually make him that outfit. But now I think it is time to make him a different outfit. So let's look in Avatar shop and see what kind of things we can buy. Let's spend his Robux. Okay, let's see if anything stands out to me. What about this one? I mean, oh my gosh. It makes his face look very crazy right now. Oh, what about a duck floaty? That's kind of cute. Hmm, actually, I don't know. I want to make him look like a princess. So maybe we should dress him as a princess today. <gasps> oh, he can be Ronaldo. That's kind of a cool one. Oh, he can be crying. Oh my gosh, that's terrifying. Okay, no. Um, Yeah, let's make him into a princess. So first of all, let's get some dresses. I want a very beautiful dress. A dress that kind of matches him. Let's have a look. Oh, a white wedding dress. Oh, <gasps> gorgeous. No, it's not really the look I'm going for, though. I think, oh, this one's really pretty. Look, a butterfly dress in pink. I think that might be it. Oh, look, it looks beautiful. If we take the shirt away. <gasps> oh, my gosh, gorgeous. Yeah, I like that. Let's go ahead and buy that. Oh, wait, they have it in blue. I think he'd prefer blue. Let's go ahead and get the blue one. Okay, let's get it in blue. Okay, beautiful. Now I think to be a princess, he needs a tiara. So let's get him a tiara. Okay, there is lots to choose from. Oh, this one's blue, so it would match like the blue dress. But I want it a bit bigger. Like I want a big tiara to stand out. Oh, look at this one. This one's so expensive though, 3,000. Oh, this one's kind of cool. It's an ice tiara. We'll see what that one looks like. Oh, this one's cool. Oh, I like this one, actually. A sky blue tiara of the hidden. Very mysterious. Okay, this tiara is not going to work because his hair is in the way. So that's going to be a no. What about this one? This one's not too bad. I don't mind that. Oh, this one's cool. This one stands out. I like this one. And they're lollipops. I mean, who doesn't want that? Okay, let's go ahead and dress him up just so I can see how he looks so far. So let's put the dress on. The lollipop. We'll take these off. Also need to take that sweater off as well. Okay, so far, so good. I think he looks very nice. Although he keeps looking down. I can't see what he actually looks like. But his neck looks a bit bare. I think he needs like a nice necklace on. So let's see if we can find a necklace for him. And maybe even a new face. Okay, I think this one is perfect. It says boss on it. So, you know, just stands out a bit more. I like this one a lot. Let's go ahead and buy it. 
Okay, so I think here is our finished look so far. I still kept the face because, you know, just say it looks like Josh. However, I think he looks even better. Look, here is the grand reveal. Beautiful. Actually, let's go into a game so I can show you guys exactly what he looks like. Oh my gosh, look at him, guys. He's gorgeous. Beautiful. The prettiest princess of them all. Although I feel like, I don't know, I feel like this isn't the look that I wanted to go for. There's just something... I don't know. I want to go for something more extreme. Let's see if I can get inspiration from his outfits. Let's see what's on here. Oh, I think I actually did make all of these. So let's see. We have his everyday outfit. Very nice. Very stylish. We have his sleep look. We have his firefighter look because that's what his job is on Berry Avenue. He is a firefighter. We have his swimming look. Scuba diving. This is then his autumn look. We have his Christmas attire. We have summer socks and sandals. Very nice, very nice. Although I do not appreciate the socks and sandals, especially in summer. We have autumn two. I like this look. The Dr. Martins. Oh, we have his workout look. I like this one a lot too. I made this myself once again. We then have his Halloween costume, which we wear at the 101 Dalmatians. Oh my gosh, what is this? I did not make this. This is a creepy outfit. Ew. When did he make this? This is scary. We then have a jock look. Oh my gosh, that's terrifying. Center of the universe. That's me. We then have a patient look. Okay, well, very nice, very nice. But anyway, I feel like the best look that he should look like, and I just thought it, should be me. I'm going to dress him up as myself, and that way I can promote myself as well, because he's got more thumbs up than I do on Ro Pro, and I want that. So I'm going to make him turn into me. Okay, there we go. I have made him into my avatar. I look beautiful. Let's go ahead and see what he looks like in Berry Avenue. Oh my gosh, stunning. Look, there I am. It was me on Josh's account. Now he'll know I definitely hacked him because I look like myself. I kind of gave myself away, really. But yeah, guys, that is basically it. Oh my gosh, wait. It shows my name on there. Look, it exposed me. But also, I realized he's a coder of this game. I could go ahead and destroy Berry Avenue, guys. I have all of the power. I won't, of course, because I also need to film role plays on there. But how cool is this? All the power I can have on here. Instead, the power I choose is to turn him into looking like myself. And that is what I did. But anyway, I hope you all enjoyed this video of me going into Josh's Roblox account and just being nosy, seeing what he does, and also changing his outfit so that he looks like me. Maybe you guys will see his reaction soon. He's actually a bit unwell at the moment, so he hasn't been in Roblox in a while. So I don't think he'll notice. So if his account is still like this, even after this video, then that means that he hasn't realized. But anyway, I just want to say a big thank you to you guys because recently I hit 1 million subscribers and it is insane. I am so, so grateful. I will do a 1 million special video very, very soon. So if I could ask you guys just to comment down below any questions that you guys have ever wanted to ask me, I'm going to do a face cam video and also like a Q&A kind of style. So you guys can ask me any questions that you've ever wanted me to answer. I'm going to answer it all in the 1 million special video, which should hopefully come up maybe next month because... I've got a lot of questions I need to answer. And yeah, I just want to celebrate my one meal first. But anyway, thank you guys so much for watching. Like the video if you guys haven't already. Subscribe to my channel if you also haven't. And I'll see you all next time.